Hello and welcome. I am Daffy Roth and this is my YouTube channel. So in our last episode, we finally got to take over as Chris on the island and um, found out that uh, we, we should have stored some stuff as Claire. So I was debating on whether or not to go back and replay those sections and I decided to do that. And I actually found something extra along the way that I didn't, I missed the first time around. And I'll show you in a second, but we got the bow gun. So we're good. To, we're good to go. Uh, however, at that cost, um, since I didn't really remember where I left off, uh, I, this is right after we saved in quotation marks, uh, Rodrigo, or whatever the hell his name was, um, and got the lighter. So we're kind of still, we're, we're back at the beginning here, but we're going to make our way through a little bit faster because now I kind of know what to expect to some extent. So, so yeah, it answered the question on where we where that uh, magazine goes into. So, what did we get? So apparently there was an assault rifle in the weapon um, in the weapon area, which I don't know how I missed, but it's literally you just go straight forward where you put the C4. And it's right there. So I like, okay, apparently I missed it. But with that being said, friends, in case you didn't realize, this is Resident Evil Code Veronica X for the PlayStation 2. And that is what we're going to continue our playthrough of today. So with that being said, sit back, relax, enjoy the show. Okay, so first order of business is to retrace all of our old steps and like the stupid freaking spiders. That's apparently a switch. So hopefully it will make the going a little bit easier, especially since I have the bow gun. Um, I just think it's kind of silly that it didn't, the game should have kind of been like, hey, here's a heads up. But. Also, I do like that, you know, the item boxes are like connected from like around the world. Okay, dude. Doing worse than before. Right, sucker, eat it. I want to be a little bit more liberal with the, uh, boozies. Only because, you know, now that I know I have the assault rifle with backup if necessary, I'm gonna be good on that, but I'm trying not to rely too much on it. Because as we know, we got those hunters coming and... I wonder why it's here. Thank <laughs> you. 
Hopefully these spiders aren't going to be a recurring thing like in the hallway of death over up in Antarctica with those stupid mobs. God, I hate those things so much. Wow, that was a blue herb. Once we defeat these stupid spiders, we'll save here. Alright, I think that's everything in here. He broke. I'm fine with that. <laughs> All right. All right, so let's put these away. That's all I wanted to use them for anyways. Um, we'll save them for a rainy day, though. But we're getting ammo now. Actually, I'm going to leave the explosive rounds for right now. Actually, no, we'll take those. And then we'll take the knife. Uh, I 
think we'll leave everything else. Oh, we did say we're gonna save. I'm just rearranging my. St Dang it, dude! The PlayStation Five controllers are like super sensitive. Uh, put this there. I mean, we do have the bow rounds if we ever, you know. But... And then shotgun. And the miscellany. Alright. Okay. I forgot the battery, didn't I? Okay, so first things first, um, we'll go... We need to get the doorknob because we need a different save room. The one that's like 800 miles away. Yes, we already read all that. I'm not going to worry about it. Okay. So we that was Chris. That was the whole I'm on a scene with Wesker. Horribly collapsed. Uh, what was in here? Oh, these guys, that's right. What in the hell, Chris? Oh, 
Kind of hoping to be able to do that with the, uh... <clears throat> the bow gun, but... Chris apparently can't aim when they're right in front of him. Need the doorknob for there. Oh, so I can't even get down this way. The Eagle Plate has flown into the sewer. There seems to be a passage below. That's a play on words. If I remember correctly, there's nothing we can do on the second floor. Oh, I'm sorry, on the first floor, but let's just check just to make sure. Oh! Crikey! Oh my gosh, what is wrong with me right now? Chris, why do you keep turning around like you want them to bite you in the back? Something seems to be on the other side of it. I can't open it. And this is just... 128 is what it was. Okay. I'm gonna do something stupid. Okay. So, you actually have to shoot them in the back for it to explode. That is good to know. Uh, let's go to B1. I'm only kind of curious and if that green mist is gonna kill me or not. The patch is filled with poison and gas. I can't go down under these conditions. Caution breaker may. F okay. The ventilation fan is stopped. Uh, I see. Well, the question is: is do I? I mean, he'll never have children. Are they gonna come up the lad, the stairs? I'm waiting. Oh, there we are.
Almost. Okay, I think I got them all. Okay, so this is where... I'm not going to pick up those ink cartridges, there's no point. Alright, this is where we get the extra ammo for the... Because I was like, where do we get the assault rifle? I was like, oh, maybe we get it later. But now Chris is going to be loaded. Unless there's gonna be like a catch, right? Because I get this, it's gonna be like, ah, uh, yeah, but now you got to fight like Tyrant Super Soldier type 5426987 Okay, so we got plenty of stuff here. So we got the doorknob. That's gonna be the first thing we want. Uh, oh, uh oh. Oh, he was waiting for me for the doorknob, huh? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, holy shit balls, there's a lot of them. Come on, Chris! What the fuck? Well then, I'll be right back. Alright, here we are, round two. Um, so I'm finding out that... Chris is taller than the enemies, which uh, causes him to fire over them. So uh, I'm ready this time. So let's uh, let's go. Okay. Um, I'm gonna say that that was a success. I mean, I'm hurting, but I'm not dead, right? Um, as far as it looks like those are my stretch Armstrongs, so or Chris's Chris, you know, stretch Armstrongs, but they're super freaking fast, so. But we know that there's some more explosive stuff up there, but... They're gonna- they're just so fast. Alright. Got some shotgun bullets. Oh, shotgun shells, rather. Yep. Okay. I think that's what it was. Yeah. <laughs> 
Perfect. What? Okay. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, man. That didn't happen last time. But then again, last time I didn't have the uh, doorknob. Well, I guess I'll be back in a second. Okay, so I managed to defeat the hunters without taking hard no damage and not wasting any rounds. So essentially it is two per the hunter. Now, my question is, is for these super duper hunters, how much does it take to them? Um, and do I actually have to fight them? So what I did is I went ahead and got the red herb from or the green herb from out out in the way. And we're gonna just grab everything in here. Cause if look, if I don't have to fight stuff in here. I mean, I blame Claire, ultimately. It's her fault. Alright, I think that's everything. Okay. So... Let us... Ugh, man. Okay, here we go. Oh, well, I still took damage, but hey, I care not. All right, so we're better off than we were. Um, we got the compound. We got everything down here. Uh, we need to get the key for the turnstile, though, so. Yes, might as well grab this. Oh, I have all this down here still. Oh, that's only a 50 percenter. Okay, well, we'll come down here and grab everything here in a second. Um, we got to go back upstairs, though. Hopefully we can get to another save box. Hey, I said the same thing when I was going back up here. Uh, where was it at first? Or... No, it would be the second floor. Okay. Got a little lost there. So, that sound leads me to believe that we can avoid the hunters if we can shoot the machine. Which would be great. Oh my gosh, what the fuck? 
man. Just die. I I am kind of curious where the zombos are coming from. I mean, I'm pretty sure between Claire and him. I like how you still stomp his brains and like his head's still there. You set the doorknob. Just Barry taught him well. This is just gonna lead to the middle room here, though. Alright. Hey, look, there's some ammo. Oh crap, we gotta go back in there. Take the tank object. Yeah, damn it. It's not what I was hoping for. That means the hunter is gonna be in there. Darn it. Oh well. Or maybe it just disappeared. It, 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 it. Nope. <laughs> that was a waste. <laughs> Freaking five. Could have killed three of those things. Sorry. We can't kill those things. Well, that's a darn shame. Oh. This. Take the turntable key. Sure. There's a file. Secret passage note. The underground passage which leads to the mansion where Alexa and I live has been badly damaged. Although I can never allow the unwashed to see Alexia, I cannot go to on using the underground waterway. 
that those local people made either. Oh yes, I think I'll have those prisoners build a bridge. It must be a gorgeous bridge that befits the perfection that is Alexia. Of course, I must kill everyone who's involved in the construction of the bridge after it is done, so that no one will know about the existence of our mansion. But that is okay, as I have no problem executing such matters. Once the bridge is complete, I'll seal the mansion entrance door at the end of the underground waterway. The entrance of the waterway is locked by the diorama trick, ensuring the secrecy of our mansion. Alfred Asher. Something is written beside the holes. Lead three armies here and the path will open. Well, how in the hell do I get... Dying around. Oh, uh, okay. Well, I guess that's gonna be for another day. All right, friends. Uh, I think we're gonna call that an episode here. I gotta figure out where we go from here. It's a lot of stuff we gotta pick up. Um, not really sure. Well, turntable is where we're headed next. So, but with that being said, friends, uh, stick around for more. I uh, appreciate your support, and um, if you like this video. You know what to do. Until next time, friends. Uh, stay happy, stay healthy, and I will see you then. Bye.